Here's an exciting update. Copilot now has a memory. I'm Kelly from the 365 Training Hub. Let's take a look. This feature is new for if you have the license for Microsoft 365 Copilot. You can tell if you've got the license because you've got a work and a web toggle. Go to the three dots, down to settings, and here we can see personalization. Under custom instructions, we can provide Copilot with specific details and guidance to improve the quality of its responses. I'd like Copilot to use simple language, New Zealand spelling, and don't include any emojis in your answers. There's also a memory option here. Let's take a look. I'll ask Copilot, how do I like to write? Copilot's scanning my internal graph information and it's picking out my writing style. Let's see if it gets it right. Simple language, New Zealand spelling, warm and engaging tone, and it's found it across my different documents, and it's giving some supporting arguments for why it's made that decision. Now it says, would you like me to remember this writing style for future help with drafting emails, documents, or training materials? And I'll say, yes, remember my writing style. Now we can see Copilot's memory has been updated. Copilot saying, got it, I'll keep it in mind that you prefer simple language, New Zealand spelling, and a warm and engaging tone. Let's see where those settings are. We'll go back to the three dots, back down to settings, and under Copilot memory, we can see that our memory has been updated with one item here. If it's not right, I can delete that memory, I can delete all memories, I can turn off this feature altogether if I want to. I think it's going to be quite helpful. I can say to Copilot something like, Remember to use bullet points whenever possible. Because I've used the prompt remember, Copilot has updated my memory. And of course, if you want to change anything, go to the three dots, back to settings, and you can delete any of those items that don't suit you any longer.